हेलो व्यूअर्स आई एम मिस्टर दिलीप कुमार पाल रीडर इन पॉलिटिकल साइंस अगेन स्टैंड्स बिफोर यू विथ ए वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट वीडियो रिलेटिंग टू ट्वेंटी फाइव मल्टीपल चॉइस क्वेश्चंस विथ आंसर्स रिलेटिंग टू प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया इन वर्ड वेरी वेल दैट इंडियन प्राइम मिनिस्टर इज ए वेरी पावरफुल पर्सन इन इंडिया ही सो मच पावरफुल दैट ही कैन बी कंपेयर विथ द अमेरिकन प्राइम अमेरिकन प्रेसिडेंट शो प्राइम मिनिस्टर इज ए वेरी पावरफुल मैन इन इंडिया so today's video is related with the 25 multiple choice questions with answers if you will go through this video a lot of benefits you can get because 25 important informations relating to prime minister will be within your hand okay very good so we'll start so the first multiple choice question regarding the office of prime minister of india is who was the first prime minister of india who was the first prime minister of india ऑप्शन सर नंबर वन लाल बहादुर शास्त्री नंबर टू जवाहरलाल नेहरू नंबर थ्री मोरारजी देसाई एंड नंबर फोर चौधरी चरण सिंह फोर ऑप्शन आर बिफोर यू बट हुज इज द आंसर द राइट आंसर इज जवाहरलाल नेहरू ही वॉज द फर्स्ट प्राइम मिनिस्टर ऑफ इंडिया ओके वेरी गुड नंबर टू Which article says there shall be a prime minister in India? Which article narrates or which article speaks there must be a prime minister in India? Options are Article seventy five, Article seventy two, Article seventy three, and Article seventy four. The right answer is Article seventy four because Article seventy four speaks. there shall be a council of minister with the prime minister the head so article 74 says there shall be a prime minister for india okay very good number 3 the prime minister is appointed by whom who appoints the prime minister options are chief justice of supreme court speaker of lok sabha Attorney General of India and President of India. Who appoints the Prime Minister? The right answer is President of India. President of India gives appointment to the Prime Minister. Okay. So out of twenty-five questions, we have already come over three questions. Again, we will go to the fourth multiple choice question. What is the term of Prime Minister of India? What is the term of the Prime Minister of India? For how many years he comes to the office? Options are four years, three years, six years, and five years. The right answer is five years. It means the Prime Minister comes to the office for five years. Okay, my dear students, come to question number five. Who is the chairman of the cabinet? In our country, we have cabinet by taking cabinet ministers, prime minister, and cabinet secretary. But the question is, who is the chairman of the cabinet? Options are cabinet secretary of centre, president of India, vice president, and prime minister. The right answer is prime minister. The prime minister is the chairman of the cabinet. okay very good 
come to question number six which article says prime minister intimates the decision of council of minister to president no doubt council of minister take the decision but who intimates decisions of the council of ministers to the president options are four you have to choice one which article says article 76 article 75 article 77 article 78 the right answer is article 78 article 78 the question is which article speaks that which article speaks that the prime minister intimate the decision of the council of minister to president question is which article speaks that prime minister intimate the decision of the council of minister to the president which article speaks so options are 74 75 77 78 right answer is article 78 article 78 of our constitution says it is the duty of the Prime Minister to intimate the decision of the Council of Ministers to the President. He is the link. The Prime Minister is the link between the Council of Ministers and the President. Okay? Very good. So, we have completed the six questions. Now, we come to the seventh question. Who for Ministry of the Union Government? Who for Ministry of the Union Government? In the Union there is a government in the state there is a government but the question is who forms government in the union or who forms union government choices are prime minister vice president president and speaker of Lok Sabha. the right answer is prime minister question number seven prime minister prime minister forms the union cabinet okay very good then come to question number 8. Who distributes portfolios of central government among ministers? No doubt, prime minister forms the government. And in the government, many ministers are found. But the question is, who distributes portfolios or who distributes departments among ministers? Choices are 4. You have to choose one. Cabinet Secretary, Vice Chairman Rajya Sabha, Speaker of Lok Sabha and Prime Minister. The right answer is Prime Minister. It is the Prime Minister who distributes portfolios or departments among his various ministers. So we have completed 8 questions. So out of 25 questions, we have already completed 8 questions, 8 number of questions. Now we will come to the ninth one. Okay, ninth one is very important. The question is, who is regarded as the sole advisor to the president? No doubt the president is the head of the country. But who is the main advisor to the president? Choices are 4 or 1. Home Minister of the Union, Vice President, Prime Minister and Cabinet Secretary of Centre. The right answer is Prime Minister. The right answer is Prime Minister. The Prime Minister is the only advisor to the President. He briefs the President. He intimates the President all informations of the country, council of ministers and cabinet. Then come to question number 10, which is very important. Who coordinates policies of different departments of the union? In the union, there are various departments. They function independently. But who brings a coordination among them? Choices are four. Planning Minister, Home Minister, President and Prime Minister. Right answer is Prime Minister. Question number 10, Prime Minister. Prime Minister coordinates among various departments. He coordinates 
policies of various departments. Just like in a team, there is a captain who coordinates team members. In the similar manner, Prime Minister coordinates policies of various departments. So out of 25 questions, we have completed 10 questions. It is a good going. Okay, very good. Then come to question number 11. Be ready, which is very important. Who is described as the interstellar lunar miners? Means a moon among lesser stars. Just like in the sky, the moon is more lighter in comparison to star because it is nearer to us. The question is, who is described as the interstellar lunar miners or a moon among lesser stars? The right, the choices are President of India, Vice President of India, Chief, uh, Chief of Army Staff and Prime Minister of India. The right answer is Prime Minister of India, question number 11, Prime Minister of India. Prime Minister of India is regarded as the interstellar lunar minors or a moon among lesser stars. Okay, very good. Then come to question number 12. Who described the Prime Minister as sun around which other bodies revolve? Who described the Prime Minister as the sun around which other bodies revolve? Here the Prime Minister is described as the sun. Because Around the sun, planets revolve. So, around the prime minister, ministers revolve. So, who has told the prime minister is like sun around with other bodies revolve? Choices are William Harcourt, Lord Morley, Lord Emery, and Ivor Jennings. The right answer is Ivor Jennings. Question number 12 Ivor Jennings. Ivor Jennings has told that. The Prime Minister is like a son around which other bodies revolve. Okay, very good. Then come to question number 13. Who describe Prime Minister as primus inter pairs? First among equals. Who has described the Prime Minister as primus inter pairs? Choices are Ivor Jennings, L.S. Emery, William Harcourt, and Lord Morley. The right answer is Lord Morley, question number 13, Lord Morley. Lord, Lord Morley has told the Prime Minister is like primus inter pairs or first among equals. Okay, my students, come to question number 14. Prime Minister is described as interstellar lunar minors or a moon among lesser stars by whom? Who has described the Prime Minister? are the interstellar lunar minors or a moon among lesser stars. Choices are four. You will have to select one. Choices are Jawaharlal Nehru, Lord Morley, Ivor Jennings and William Harcourt. Right answer is William Har Harcourt, put in William Harcourt. William Harcourt has described the Prime Minister as the interstellar lunar minors or a moon among lesser stars. Okay, so now you come to question number 15. Already we have completed 14 multiple choice questions with answers. Now you come to question number 15. Who gives oath to the Prime Minister? No doubt the Prime Minister comes to the office for 5 years. But who gives oath? Who delivers oath? Who tenders oath to the Prime Minister? The right answer is, right, the choices are, you have to select. Chief Justice Supreme Court, President, Vice President and Speaker of Lok Sabha. The right answer is President of India, 15 President of India. The President of India gives oath to the Prime Minister. Then we have already completed 15 questions out of 25. Still 10 important questions are left my beloved viewers. The 16th one is who should, what should be the minimum age for the Prime Minister? What should be the minimum age for the office of Prime Minister? Choices are for 30 years, 35 years, 32 years and 25 years. The right answer is 25 years, 
who is in 16, 25 years. Unless a person will be of 25 years, he cannot be the Prime Minister at the minimum age. Yes. Then come to question number 17. The Prime Minister must have qualification of which house? Joshua Sah, Rajya Sabha, Legislative Assembly of State, Legislative Council of State and Lok Sabha. The right answer is Lok Sabha. Question number 17, Lok Sabha. Okay, very good. Then come to question number 18. Who presides meetings of the Union Cabinet? No doubt in our country there is a cabinet. But who presides the meeting of the Union Cabinet? Questions are, choices are, President, Speaker of Lok Sabha, Chairman of Rajya Sabha and Prime Minister. The right answer is Prime Minister, question number 18, Prime Minister. Prime Minister presides the cabinet meeting. He convenes the cabinet meeting. He will decide what will be discussed in the cabinet meeting. Then come to question number 20. Who is the leader of the country? Who is our leader? Choices are four. You will have to select one. President, Chief of Defense Staff, Speaker of Lok Sabha and Prime Minister. The Prime Minister is the leader of the country. Question 19. Prime Minister is the leader of the country. Then come to question number 20. Who is described as central to its formation, central to its life and central to its death of Union Government? Who is described as central to its formation, central to its life and central to its death of Union Government? Choices are again before you four. You will have to select one. Choices are President, Home Minister, Vice President and Prime Minister. The right answer is Prime Minister, question number 20, Prime Minister. Prime Minister is the is regarded as the central to its life, central to its death and central to its formation. So out of 25 questions, we have completed already 20 questions. Still 5 important questions are left which you will know which will enhance your knowledge. Question 21. Who is described as the leader of parliament? Who is described as the leader of parliament? Question 21. Choices are again four. President, Vice President, Speaker of Lok Sabha and Prime Minister. Right answer is Prime Minister. Article 21. Prime Minister is known as the leader of parliament. Then come to Question number 22, which is very important, very crucial. The question is, which Prime Minister gave a slogan? Jai Jawan, Jai Kisan. Options are again for Jawaharlal Nehru, Indira Gandhi, Muraroji Desai, Lal Bhav Shastri. The right answer is Lal Bhav Shastri. He gave the slogan, Jai Jawan, Jai Kisan. 22, Lama Shastri. Then come to question 23. Which Prime Minister had longest tenure? Which Prime Minister had longest tenure? He was the Prime Minister for a long time. Options are Indira Gandhi, Otal Bihari Baspe, Guljar Nanda and Jawaharlal Nehru. Right answer is Jawaharlal Nehru, 23. Jawaharlal Nehru, he continued up to for 16 years. Long tenure he possessed. Long tenure he had. Then come to question number 24. It is very, very important. The strength of council of ministers of the union should not be more than how much percentage of the looks of no doubt a council of ministers will form, but it should not be more than what percentage of the looks of her. Choices are here again for 16%, 12%, 20% and 15%. Right answer is 24, right answer is 15%. It means the council of ministers which will form. It should not be more than 
15% of the total strength of the Lok Sabha. Then the last person awards for you, who said, if there is any function in, function in our country, if there is any person in our country, who can be compared with American president, who is that? If there is any person in our country who can be compared with American president, who is that? It is the Prime Minister. First, who has told it? Who has told if there is any person in our country who can be compared with the American president? It is the Prime Minister, not President. Who has told it? Joshi Sar, Jawaharlal Nehru, K. Munsi, Sardar Patel, and B. Rambedkar. The right answer is B. R. Ambedkar, question 25. B. R. Ambedkar. Because B. R. Ambedkar has told it is the Prime Minister of India who can be compared with the American President. It is not President of India who can be compared with the American President. It is the Prime Minister of India who can be compared with the American President. Okay? My viewers, I think this video is will be very much essential for you. It will be very much essential for all type of students. I think it will be beneficial to you. It will give 25 important informations to the about the office of the Prime Minister. I think it will be very much useful for you for your academic sphere. If you like, you will give the comment, you will, you will subscribe my channel, so the benefit will be yours. Thank you viewers, again we will be here with another video, till now, goodbye to all.